Hello again, it's the Waltered 61. Today we're going to have a nice little video where we're going to discuss buttons. Oh, as soon as we get through this door. Now, everyone has had this happen to them where the pulse of the button to open the door is just too short. Or say you want a pressure plate. And, oh, nope, didn't make it. What if there was a design? It would allow the door to stay open for longer. A design that allowed a pressure plate to hold open the door for you across almost 20 blocks, Val. There is. Ladies and gentlemen, the RS Nor Latch. Uh, fairly easy to build little circuit here. Um, we're going to go ahead and spotlight. Has tons and tons of uses for. Uh, a lot more complex designs. It's basically a memory cell, but we're not going to worry necessarily about that right now. What we're going to focus on the fact is that they can be designed and used to make button pulses and pressure plate pulses last longer. Looks simple. Guess what? It is simple. Let's build it. All right. First things first, put down a block. Put on that block a redstone torch. Place two pieces of redstone right there. Place another block, another redstone torch. Boom, more redstone. Get yourself a little yin and yang kind of situation going on right there. All right, all right. Off the active torch here, you're going to run a couple bits of redstone to whatever you want to operate in this example like I said we're using a door there we go that's not a good place for that door boom doors open correct correct okay now your button is gonna come off of this block right here okay so run some redstone place a block now the problem is you need this torch to be active right now and this one to be off. So if you're building it and it ends up like this with that one uh, active, what you need to do is come over to this block here, place yourself a button, hit that button exactly once, it resets the entire system, boom. Alright. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to rig this up so this button will do the reset for us because if you hit the button right now, it'll flip it and this button no longer works okay we want the door to open just long enough we don't want it to stay open permanently so coming off of this block here all you need to do is place some repeaters however many you want it is up to you all that matters is they need to end up pointing at this block right here you can set them for however long of a delay you want. It is up to you however long you want your door to open. All right. So you operate it. The pulse comes up through here. And it closes the door again behind you. Instead of the... Well, that's not going to work. Instead of the half second pulse you get from a regular button press you can extend it for as long as you want simple right right all right that's all for today right now thanks for watching hope it was easy to understand go ahead and click that like button if you enjoyed the video and want to see more please feel free to leave me a comment below about anything you want to talk about I like to respond to all my comments personally I try to get back to them in a fairly regular regular uh, fashion um, and please, by all means, go ahead and click that subscribe button. That way you'll be first in line for the new stuff. So, until next time, thanks for watching. And, bye-bye.